Can you tell me why people should keep coming to conferences like this when so much is available on the internet? I think the key is what you see in an event like this evening. It's the networking. So the benefit people have when they come is they actually meet people. Whether or not it's like some of the big speakers, particularly for the younger engineers, they want to come and meet these, these people that they've read a lot of their work, but they've never seen them, and they, they really enjoy that. Or the more senior engineers that just want to network and interact. So you see an awful lot of networking business going on that, of course, you, you can't do over the internet effectively. I'm Liz Smith. I'm a senior principal with Terracon Consultants. I have to say, everything I do here is so much fun. Even the committee meetings that go to midnight, mm -hmm. uh, because there's so many of my friends and colleagues. I've been coming to the GI meeting, and I've been on the Deep Foundations Committee for 18 years, and so it's just a great time to network and meet my colleagues, and you can do a little recruiting, as well as learn a whole lot of professional things. And did you have a favorite event that you attended? Well, that's, uh, that's a good question. I like to go to like the Terzaghi lecture, the Peck lecture tomorrow, the Osterberg lecture, because mm -hmm. a lot of the people that were giving them were friends of mine, so I wanted to see them uh, uh, do a good job up there, and then maybe uh, kid with them a little bit, you know, afterwards. And, and they need that, they, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, my name is Ming Xiao, I'm a faculty at Penn State, and uh, well, the first priority for me to attend the uh, GEO Congress is to reconnect with my colleagues in the field, and uh, we see maybe once or twice only a year and get to talk to them and see what's going on and uh, also to come to the uh, technical committee meetings every year. It's a kind of must-have event.